Here are five commanders you'll play against that you actually want to survive. Maelstrom Wanderer. This deck is all about big mana and huge spells, and removing Maelstrom Wanderer means facing down two more Cascade Triggers. So just try to chump block and focus on player removal instead. Yuriko, the Tiger's Shadow. I see this mistake made a lot. You have to kill Yuriko's evasive buddies and leave her stranded alone on the battlefield. Killing her is almost pointless and will just lead to more ninjutsu triggers. Torgar, Famine Incarnate. If you didn't get hit with the first ETB trigger, you definitely don't want to kill this. It's just a vanilla 7-6, so make your opponent go through the trouble of sacrificing it rather than making their job easier. Carter, Doom Scourge. This guy can mess you up, but sending him back to the command zone won't help you much and only guarantees a future trigger. Let him stick and get in those attacks while you can. And Kineos and Tiro of Miletus. Their ability is lopsided towards their controller, but it really isn't that bad for anyone else. Take your free resources and use them to execute your own plans. Subscribe for more non-violence. Peace out, Tribe Scout.